Nest. As soon as it, oh, there's nice ones too. I might just do this for a little while. <laughs> nice, buddy. Good job. Set go. Oh, that's beautiful colors on it. Yeah, nice job. Yeah. Man, you guys, we have just been putting on a clinic catching these bluegills today, like one after another. Unreal. It's been good. It's been really good. Yeah, I, I love this system so much. In a little bit, we're gonna do a little big fish contest for some bass. And uh, I know for a fact this guy here and his son Leo definitely got some horseshoes and that's why I love fishing with them. So let's see, uh, we'll show you guys how quick it is for these, these pan fish. So I'm pulling it up on this nest here. Let's go ahead and zoom in on that bobber. That's gonna sink any second. And it's been like that for, I mean, it's been nonstop. So we're getting a little sick of this. So we're gonna go do some bass fishing with these guys for a little bit. Not too bad. Another. Oh, I missed one. Right away? Oh, right away. Oh, no way. Oh, man. Well, I'm gonna get one. Oh, hey, you got one. Oh, oh. oh it's Ooh. a good one. This feels like a big one. That's nice. Oh! Come on now. Come on. <laughs> that was a big one. Oh, man. <laughs> oh, man. Man. Oh, Bobber's oh, under. Oh, oh, oh. We're in the Hornets' nets, guys. Oh. Oh! Come on now. More axes. Guys. This is a, a blast, you guys. Man, There's every time we put in there, we're smashing them. I'm gonna catch one more bluegill, so one more gill, and then I'm challenging my kid and Andy to a one hour bass fishing tournament. <laughs> one more, one more. Ooh, that's, that's a good one. Good fish. <laughs> yeah, man, this is a blast. This is just like being a kid and just watching your bobber and just smashing these fish. It's a good, good fit. Fish. That does definitely looks like one. There we go. Look at that. Wow, what a nice looking fish. Beautiful eater, for sure. That's gonna taste good. Nice. Hey, if you guys get a chance to uh Go out with my buddy Andy Tao. I highly recommend a guide trip with him. He's a super fun guy to fish with. And you know, I've been fishing for my whole life and I didn't know that I could learn more about bluegill fishing, but he showed me a lot about bluegill fishing today. And uh, it's been so much fun. All right, man, let's go do some bass fishing. Right on. In one of the last videos I uploaded, I showed how we can sight fish for these bluegills on their beds. Now, if you're fishing in water clarity that's really stained and you can't see the beds and you can't see the bluegills one option that we have is uh, different locators and sonar and things like that and he's going to show us how he uses his side imaging to locate bluegills he's using uh, the hummingbird solex 15 mega side imaging so let's see how he does this right here um, right above my finger there you can see a couple of uh, bluegills on those dots or on those craters there so those are the nests there. We're gonna be coming up on some more here in a second. So I put a waypoint there, but inside these inside these um, craters, these nests here, um, have a bunch of bluegills. Right here, there's a bunch of bluegills inside that nest there right now. You can actually see all of them just sitting in there. So we are gonna do big fish tournament. We have one hour to fish, and what are we fishing for? 500? Five. Five dollars. <laughs> we don't have five hundred dollars. <laughs> We're fishing for five dollars. We're gonna see who wins the big fish tournament. Who's it gonna be? Probably me. Probably Leo. Leo, Probably. Leo does have a horseshoe, that's for sure. Yeah. Alright. Let's do it. A 
okay, so for one hour in our bass tournament, I had a pretty good idea. I decided to basically go to the docks and totally front end Leo and leave him in the back of the boat with nothing to cast at. And, um, and that was pretty much my game plan to start, the, start off our tournament. Oh, nice smallie. Nice. Fish number one, Leo's on the board. We gotta, we gotta measure this to see oh, yeah. how big it is. I got a scale too and uh... Yeah, hold, hold it up for us. There we go, nice are we, smallie. Are we weighing them or? Let's just measure them, let's just bump them. Yeah. Oh man, I'm gonna be so upset if I owned up owing my kid $5. I'll tell you what, Andy and I, we came into the docks, didn't we Andy? And yep. we, we're totally front ending Leo so that we catch the fish <laughs> and then he catches the first fish. It's ridiculous. We did mark a lot out there though. <laughs> All right. 14 and a quarter. All right? 14. 14. Mm, yep. All right, big fish so far is 14 inches. We will upgrade. We got we got about 55 minutes left and we're going to upgrade. I got a small bass. It's not going to be Leo's. I'm thinking it's 12 inches. I'm going to bump it just in case, but he's got a 14. I think this is a 12. We're about 10 minutes into our tournament. We still have what does that equal? 50 minutes left. <laughs> right, okay. <laughs> All right, here we go. It's not going to be Leo's. I think it's 12 inches. Yeah! <laughs> nice, Leo! Oh, yeah! On the grass jig. Yeah. Nice That's job. Well, we better bump it and see what Dude, we there got. There's a bunch of bait fish like jumping up. Do you see that when I was feeling it? Yeah. Where's here's the bump board down there? Well, Leo, Leo might be winning this little friendly tournament here. He's got another good bass. This one ripping the bass jig through the weeds. A little over 16. All right. Good job, buddy. Oh yeah, come into the, get into the boat. Yeah. I don't know if it's gonna beat Leo's. What was yours? 16. 16, I bet you it's 15. Wait a minute, I thought his was 14. Fi right? No, he had a he had a one was 15, 16, 15. Oh that's right. Marking a bunch of big fish along those beds. Guys, we are running and gunning to spot after spot after spot. You know, one hour tournament, and we're fishing a lake that we don't really know very well, so we're just we're just hitting every spot we can. I think, you know, judging by the sun, we probably have another 20 minutes left, maybe 15, 20 minutes left. Let's see if we can stick a couple more fish. So far, Leo's in the lead by one inch. Not for long. Andy, how many you got, buddy? <laughs> <laughs> you Andy, edited that one Andy. out. <laughs> there you go. Good job, buddy. It's not 17, though. No, it's not. It's not winning the tournament. Thanks, buddy.
field. Feels good. This could be the winning bass. It might be. Don't shake off, don't shake off. Oh, it's good. Oh, that's at least 18 right there. Oh, yeah! <laughs> that could be the winning bass, guys. Look at that. I think I won the tournament, unless you guys can get one in the next 10 minutes. <laughs> Let's see, I'll bump them. That's 18 for sure. Think so? Yeah. I don't know. I'm gonna say 17, but I think it beats Leo's. All right. Oh, that's an 18. You think that's 18? Yeah. That's 18. Too. All right, guys. It's the moment of truth. Oh yeah. It's not 18. It's like seven, 17 and three quarters. What? That's not 18. Boom! 17 and three quarters. I think I won the tournament, guys. Maybe, unless you guys can hurry up and get one. See you later, buddy. Thank you. Thanks for the battle. All right, you guys. Man, we had a... Oh, <laughs> trying to do the outro, but Andy can't stop catching fish. What is it? It's a perch. Nice perch. Here. Here. Oh! Can I do my outro now? Yes. You can All right. Do your outro All right. Now. You just unhook that fish or something. All right, guys. So... Wow, we had an amazing time fishing today. I want to thank my buddy Andy for getting us out. And, uh, you know, I don't want to brag, but I'm going to brag a little bit, and that is I won the bass tournament. I think I won by, like, an inch or two. But, I mean, the main thing is I beat my kid, you know, and that's the most important thing. Um, <laughs> not beat him, beat him, but, you know, I beat him in the tournament. So, But anyways, guys, I want to say thank you guys for all your – Leo's hooked up. I can't get, I can't get this Leo's outro done. Here we go. Look. Oh, if he wins the tournament right now, I'm gonna freak. But this could be, he could beat me. He could beat me. Do you need a net? Ooh. You get the net, Andy. Yeah, man. All right. Oh, uh, never mind, I got it. You got it? Yeah, I got it. How big is it? Oh, that might be close. Oh, guys, did he just win the tournament during the outro? Are you kidding me? We should have officially called it. Here, let's bump it. Let's bump yeah, it and see. Oh, this is crazy, you guys. Right, right at the end of the day, and it was like Leo's taking his last cast, so I'm doing the outro, and he he hooks up. What was the other one was seventeen. Right? Seventeen is the number to beat. Where's the bottom board? Think. Right here. It's right by my foot. 16. 16! Guys, I still won the bass tournament. <laughs> yes! Leo owes me $5. I almost got I'm super pumped about outro. this. <laughs> okay. Anyways, guys. Thank you so much to all of our subscribers and to all the likes and all the comments and everything like that. I love you guys. Thank you to the Fighting the Fish family. And we'll catch you next time on Fighting the Fish! Fighting the fish!